Well, hey everyone, Joy here. It is Saturday, September 24, 2016. And I had work this morning, but I didn't have to work very long, only two or three hours, uh, because I'm training a new girl. And so, um, she was wonderful and caught on quickly, and, and I think it's gonna work out beautifully. Um, my friends and those of you that listen to me regularly know that the girl that I was working because of, that I've been extremely patient with and waited and waited and waited and waited for, um, called the other day and said she wasn't coming back. So, and then I was really looking forward to seeing her when she did come back to get her things and she came in when she knew I wasn't going to be there. And so that was like a <clears throat> major punch in the heart um, that I don't understand and so if I don't seem my happiest most jovial self that's why I, I just have the hardest time understanding people you know um, you get attached to people you have years and years history with people and you think they really care about you and you just find out people can can just put on a face just put on a face and when they go away they take it off and there's somebody completely different so anyway excuse me if I don't seem super super happy today even though I am I have a thousand blessings I have lots of wonderful friends and I have great and many things to be grateful for but why I'm here is several people all of a sudden out of the blue I don't know maybe it's the angle I've been um, recording my videos at I'm not sure but several people have asked me um, the pattern for the pink quilt on the wall. And I have said many times through my videos what that pattern is. Uh, that pink quilt is called Strawberry Sunday. And I will show you the book that I got it out of. Hold on one second. Are you ready? Ta-da! It's this book. This is not a new book. This is an old book. I don't even know if it's still in publication from the price of it, $26.95. It's evidently not that old. Let me tell you when it was published. <sighs> if you can even tell these things. It looks like it was published in 2005. Um, not sure about that. It's just 2005 is part of the number down there. So I'm thinking um, that's probably about when I would have bought it. And it's written by Nicole Chambers. It's a wonderful book. And the quilt that I made is on the cover. Her quilt is called Butterscotch Sunday. So I decided to make mine pink and call it a Strawberry Sunday. So let me see if I can find it in here. This is a wonderful book. It's got lots of, um, well, she calls them easy quilts. I don't call anything that has points an easy quilt. Now let me see if I can find it. There it is. Look, there it is in black and beige. Isn't it a fun quilt? I think it's awesome. My husband doesn't like it. My husband doesn't like quilts that don't have pictures in them. <laughs> so, I can't help her change that. Let me see. Does it show the one on the cover anymore? There it is. Here's the one on the cover. Right here. That's the Butterscotch Sunday version. See? And so, mine is 70 by 70. It was quilted by Rhonda Beyer. Ooh, I bet it's gorgeous in real life. That girl knows how to quilt. And so, mine is Strawberry Sunday. There were several others. Here it is on a couch. Isn't this a cool book? The photographs are so nice and the way it shows everything. And um, there were some others in here that I thought I would make. But I, I liked this one because of all the room there is on it for quilting. So I've got so many quilts in the works now that these books just stay on the shelf. Here's another picture of this one. This is the one that's on the cover. Isn't that cool? Really nice book. And the quilting shows up really good on it. Yeah, I quilted mine with roses. Um, I'll take the camera off. Let me show that up close again so you can see how Rhonda Byer quilted it. Where are you, little quilt? She quilted it with grids and with a, um, I don't know if you can see it, 
with a uh, template of some sort, it looks like. <laughs> I'm back. I just chopped out a sneeze. So I'm going to take the camera off the tripod and I'm going to show you how I quilted it. Not that anybody asked for that, but I'll show it to you anyway. Hold on. Okay, here we are. Strawberry Sunday. You see now how it's the same quilt? And I quilted mine with the roses. Roses and leaves. See? That's the sad thing about quilts is you just can't see the quilting in them. And the quilting is what makes it. Let me see. I'm trying to get the center of that one. I guess that's it. Roses. Roses. Aren't they pretty? Well, I think they're pretty. And there's the leaves. Roses and leaves. When I first started, my long arm, these, ooh, that's got a spot on it. Oh my, hope that's not ink or something. This has been hanging here for ever since I built the room. Anyway, and the borders, I just continued the roses out there in the borders and into the triangles. Okay, so that's it. Strawberry Sunday. And this is the book. More simple quilts with splash, dash, and panache. Nicole C. Chambers. Okay? Bye for now. See you next time.